Hey, this is Greg Peckman at Best Way Mortgage. Just want to touch base with you with your tip of the week. Um, I've been staying on this theme about just concentrating on the mortgages uh, for the daily tip, and this is no different. So uh, just give you a heads up here. There is 100% financing still out there in two forms. Uh, you have VA financing, so if somebody's a veteran um, or somebody's in the military, that's 100% financing. Uh, if you're disabled, there's a lot of times there's a funding fee that's associated with the VA that gets tacked on the actual loan amount. So that could be waived if you're disabled. Okay, so that's the first way. Um, and, and there's a lot more details with VA too. So if you've got any questions, just please let me know. Same with the second one, which is USDA. USDA is 100% financing. I know in Palm Coast and I know in the Tri-Cities area in Tennessee, there's a lot of homes that are eligible for USDA. Okay, so with USDA, uh, it's 100% financing. You, you have a guarantee fee uh, which is included, uh, which is rolled in, but with USDA compared to say somebody wants to go FHA, with USDA 100% financing, the payment's gonna be a lot cheaper than going with FHA with 3.5% down. So anytime you can go that way, it's very important for us to kind of explore that avenue because um, it's gonna save you a lot of money per month. And then obviously if you take that money, you apply it to the principal, you apply it towards compound interest. When you, when you run those numbers out long term, uh, it really saves you a lot of money. So anyway, those are two tips. So 100% financing is alive and well. Um, so there are some changes coming down the pike, but I think those two are pretty stable right now. Okay, I will talk to you next week. And I don't recommend driving and doing this, but hey, you know, I'm trying to get this out to you guys and gals. Have a great day. Bye.